Well, the University of Virginia really is one of the nation's great universities. It has a long, rich history, and, and its scale is one of its great attributes. That provides us with a, a tight-knit, collaborative community that really can build teams and work together very easily on ground. Innovation comes from bringing people around a theme that have disparate knowledge base and have very different types of technical background. And we often talk about filling the knowledge gap between people is what is the spark of innovation. So our strategy this year for the first time, I believe, in the school's history required our department chairs to build collaborative teams across the school and to build hiring plans that were not about their department, but were organized in an interdisciplinary way around the, the different themes where we have strength. Students today are very interested in experiential education, not just being in the classroom and having an instructor talk to them, but they really want to learn with their hands. They want to learn through doing. And this is actually one of the most effective ways that we can teach students and get them really engaged passionately in, in learning. They come into my office and they say, how can I get involved in research? I'm a freshman, I don't really know anything, but I want to get involved in research and exploration with my hands. I want to learn by doing. This is where we have great opportunity in an interdisciplinary research environment. Research isn't just about conducting science and engineering to write papers. It's really a very rich learning environment. It's just not for faculty and for PhD students. It's for the 18-year-old, it's for the 20-year-old, it's for the first year, it's for the fourth year, it's for the master's student, it's for the doctoral student, it's for the postdoc. And we have an opportunity to create essentially vertical connections between those different demographic groups in ways that we never had before. Uh, and the, the learning that goes on in that type of environment, that's not in a classroom, that's not structured. And there's a sense, I think, in times in society that you know, when you have a research enterprise and you have faculty that are involved in research, somehow they're not interested in undergraduate. In fact, I think that's exactly the opposite of what actually occurs. And I, I think back on my own career and my own life, my best teachers were the best researchers and the best scholars. They were the whole package. Why were they, they the best teachers? Because they really loved what they did. They loved what they were learning about, what they were exploring. Their science was important to them. They brought it into their laboratory, but they brought it into the classroom too. And the student who sees that experience as somebody who's not only a, a knowledgeable about a topic, but lives and breathes the topic, and that's pushing the knowledge base, in it. and that they're in the classroom teaching them and sharing that passion about the knowledge. That's an experience that's just transformative. We've had a wonderful undergraduate program here uh, in the past. We're going to have an even better one going forward.